In this video tutorial, we'll show you how to configure a nodal ninja pole horizontally, which will allow a user to shoot panoramas with the pole and mount, parallel with the ground. We'll be using a nodal ninja pole with one tripod adapter, two nodal ninja L brackets, and two tripods. And for the pano head configuration, we'll use the automated mecha single axis rotator with the R1, and also the dual axis mecha. The parts used in this video will be listed below in the description. Depending on the weight of the camera mount and head, along with the desired length of the pole being extended, you may need to adjust the tripod distance for better support. When using poles in a horizontal fashion, never extend pole segments beyond 50% of their full length capabilities. Step 1. Tighten the tripod adapter onto the nodal Ninja L bracket securely. Be sure you are using the newer generation tripod adapter which incorporates four anti-twist sockets. These align with the four anti-twist pins on the right angle adapter. Step 2. Mount the tripod adapter L bracket to the top of the tripod and tighten. Step 3. Mount the second nodal Ninja L bracket securely onto the second tripod. Step 4. With the two tripods spaced approximately 3 feet, or 1 meter apart, slide the base of the pole, through the tripod adapter so it meets up with the second L bracket. Be sure to remove the two O rings from the base of the pole. They will not be needed when mounting onto the lower L bracket. Step 5. Secure the base of the pole to the L bracket and tighten securely using the L bracket tightening knob. You may need to fine tune the height of the second tripod, so that the pole is parallel with the ground. Step 6. Tighten the tripod adapter clamp using the knob on the clamp. Step 7. We will now mount the single axis automated mecha rotator, with the affixed nodal Ninja R1, onto the opposite side which is the top portion of the pole, and tighten securely. Next, mount the camera with lens onto the R1, and securely tighten using the Arca Swiss clamp tightening knob. When using the dual axis mecha, mount the lower rotator with rail assembly first, directly onto the top of the pole and tighten. Now, mount the upper mecha rotator with controller assembly, to the lower assembly unit. Please know that there are other configurations as well, using standard panoramic tripod heads.